and I hope you all are doing great. Happy Sunday to you all. Happy Sunday to you all, family. I know you can hear the background in the background. You can hear, you no, know, it's raining. In case you are hearing some noise, it's raining. So it's raining all right here. So how are you all doing? I hope you are doing wonderful, great. We took some time off, so we'll be spending time with the Lord in God's presence, interceding on your behalf. Pray for you all. We miss you, family. We miss you guys so much. But thank God that we are here. Thank God that we are back. I'm so grateful to the Lord that we are back again to share the word of God to you. To deliver the word of God to you. Hallelujah, family. Hallelujah. I have a word that I just want to um, quickly share with you all family i believe this world is for somebody and this world is for you the word is walk with god and see if i will not bless you your work with god and see if i will not bless you so this word is for you god is telling you to walk with him to see if he will not bless you there's nobody that will walk with god but god will not bless that person there's no christian that we walk with God, that God will not bless such person. When you take out your time, you dedicate your time in the things of God, in the things of God, God will surely bless you. God will surely open your wings for you. No matter the position that you find yourself, the little thing that you're doing for God is a work. The little things that you think that you're doing, you're committing yourself into the things of God. When you commit yourself into the things of God, God Himself will connect Himself to you, He commit Himself to you, and you will have this personal relationship with God. But so many people, they don't want to work with God. So many of us, we don't want to work with God. We are too busy. To work with him we are too busy doing things that we don't supposed to be doing things that are not relevant no things that you know that we will not benefit from too busy for god when you are too busy for god god will be too busy for you too so when you spend out your time and take out your time to work with him god will work with you look at the people that work with him in the bible cannot work with god cannot work with god and he never died. God took Enoch away. Look at Abraham. Abraham walked with God. See how God blessed Abraham. Because why? Abraham spent his time. His time. Abraham dedicated himself into the things of God. He gave himself to God. He surrendered his all to God. And he dedicated his time. Everything about him to God. And look, what did, look, at, look at what God did for Abraham. Abraham was so rich in everything. If Abraham did not work with God, I don't think Abraham will receive those blessings that he received. If Abraham did not work with God, if Abraham did not give himself to God, if Abraham did not call to God and surrender all to God, say, God, I want to work with you. I don't think God will bless Abraham the way he blessed him. But Abraham chose to work with God. God is telling you today, say, come and walk with me and I want to bless you. Come and walk with me and I, God, I want to bless you. Dedicate your time to God. Don't be too busy for God. Dedicate your time uh, with God. Say, God, I want to walk with you. There's no way you will walk with God and God will not bless you and God will not reward you. Every work that you do, every work that you're working with God, every time that you're standing with God, everything that you find yourself in the kingdom of God that you're doing that is pleasing God, there's always reward for everything. There's always reward for every work that you do here on earth. We as the Christians, there's always reward. God always rewards us. He always remembers because he sees everything. He sees your commitment. He sees what you're doing. He sees everything. He holds the heaven and hands. God wants you to walk with him. If only you open up to God, I want to walk with you. God, let's, I want to walk. You know, have this conversation one-on-one -on -one with you and your father. He can hear you say, Father, I want to walk with you with the heart of my heart. I want to walk with you with the heart of my life. I want to walk with you. My family wants to walk with you. I want to dedicate my time to walk with you and see how your life will turn out to be and see the wonderful blessing that God is going to bless you with 
and see the wonderful thing that God is going to bless you. David walked with God. But look at the life of David, just now. Many of them, they walk with God. But see how they live. Look at their life. Their life was so glorious. Their life was so wonderful. Why? Because they walk with God. God is telling you today, family, you that is watching me right now, God is telling you, say, come and walk with me. Come and walk with me. Dedicate your time. I need out your time. I need out your dedication. I need you. Walk with me and I want to bless you and I want to pour my blessing upon you and I want to open the window of heaven to pour my blessing upon you and I I want to lift you up and I want to raise you above your enemy and I want to do the signs of wonders in your life that will shock people around you and I want to do a marvelous thing for you that no man when they see it they will be amazed God wants to bless you if you don't work with God God cannot bless you if you don't have time for God if you don't have time to fellowship with him if you don't have time to commit your thing into the kingdom of into the kingdom of God, you don't have time uh, 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 to, to commit yourself into the kingdom of God. God will not have time for you. God wants to have time for you. So many people, we are so far from God. We are there's this distance between me and God. It's not supposed to be so. It's not supposed to. Be so. God is telling you today. Say, come and walk with me, and I go will bless you, and I go will open your ways, and I go will do signs and wonders for you, and. I I God will lift you and I God will surprise you. Oh my shakatana. I'm ready. I'm ready to walk with God. Write it all that the cover down below. Say, I'm ready to walk with God. I'm ready to dedicate my time with God. I'm ready to give myself into the things of the kingdom. I'm ready to follow him. I'm ready to follow him. I'm ready to do what he has me to do. To do what he wants me to do. I'm ready. As you're ready, your life will turn around. Your life will turn around. Your life will turn around. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. As you made that decision, as you made that boss step to this, God, I want to walk with you. God, we dedicate the time for you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You have been struggling for too long. God is telling you right now. He said, Come and walk with me. You have been suffering for too long, but God is telling you right now. He said, Come and walk with me and see if I will not pour my blessings upon you and see if I will not pour my grace upon you. God is looking for who he wants to walk with. God is looking for who he wants to bless. Are you available? Are you available for him to bless you? Are you available for him to bless you? Mako shakata na ba. Lida na ba shakata. Malida na ba shakata. Ledo sakata na ba. Aku soko paria na ba. Lida na ba shakata na ba. Aku paria na ba. Ikatosa balika dasha. As you made that decision today, you will say turn around your life in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus you will say charge your life in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth Makasha Kadanaba Lida Namo Sokropaya Lida Namo Shaha Malika De Yadabo Shaha Lika Lida Namo Thank you Lord Jesus mm. Thank you Father we give it all the glory we give it all the praise. This word is for somebody. This word is for somebody. This word is for somebody that is watching me right now. This word is for you. This word is for you. Take out your time. Leave what you're doing as dedicate yourself into the things of God. Dedicate yourself into the work of God. Give yourself to the work of God. Wherever things that you find yourself doing for the Lord is going to appreciate Him. And God is going to bless you for in Jesus mighty name we are praying amen may God bless you family 
May God shine a face upon you. May the Lord bless you richly. Bless your home and your family richly. Have a wonderful day, family. The Lord. Please don't forget to subscribe. Please subscribe, subscribe. Please subscribe. Have a blessed day. Bye, family.